Well, apparently a blue uh, griffin went over 69. Oof. You gotta fight raptors, boys. Uh, Did these raptors eat, like, flaming Hot Cheetos or something? What the hell? <laughs> Doesn't matter, they look cool. I mean, you know, if the, you know, part of me wants to know why these weren't included in Jurassic Park. That would have been hilarious. Oh my gosh, it's already bad enough Jurassic Park has, like, a bad controversy with, like, how the dinosaurs look. <laughs> And then imagine if you added those, they would, it would just confuse everyone. It was a, it was a <laughs> different iteration of how dinosaurs would... Bully him! Be. Bully him! Bully! Oh, come on, get... Dinosaur I got kid. way too many lives at this point. I need to just, like, stop pressing that. Like, a part Man. of me feels bad for going so overboard with the amount of lives, but at the same time, we can just put in as many lives as possible while playing a game that's kind of made to be cheap on you. I got Basically. so many quarters, man. Like, it's, it's a thing, like, I remember when they started releasing these things on, like, Xbox Live Arcade on the 360, to where it was like, they put out this game, they put out The Simpsons, uh, oh, the, the X-Men arcade game, mm -hmm. and it was one of those things, like, yeah, you can get through it with, like, infinite lives, and, like, there's still something to enjoy about it, but, they like, it defeats sure. the purpose. Yeah, for like yeah, people who weren't boy, there, got if you had like no memory of it. Come on, everybody, boy like, him! <laughs> yeah, like, like you would like, like, why now. did, why were, why was this a thing? And it's like, nah, it was cool. There we go. Cause, yeah, Cause like people don't really understand it until like, because they weren't really there, I guess. Yeah. Like, for some people, like, I guess with some people, they'll be like, well, what, okay, the Atari, I'm playing it right now. Why? Why is the game so primitive? Why is it so boring? Because there wasn't anything like it at the time. Yeah. Also... And even, and even then, yeah. I like that Shredder was the figurehead. <laughs> <laughs> Ninjas oh. on a pirate ship? Black Yar har fiddly the turtles oh. are now pirates! Ow, my foot. Man, thinking of play What happened oh. to their faces? What the heck? You are a pirate! They like turn half lizards, half turtles. Well, he is a turtle, and the they are reptiles. The pirate song was from Lazy Town, wasn't it? Ow! Get off! Yeah, me. I don't, I don't remember. Yeah, it um, was. Yeah, it was from. It was. Yeah, it was from Lazy Town. We are number one. Oh, great! There are floor traps. Great. Oh, God. Rest, rest in peace, <laughs> Carl Stefan. Yeah. Um. And fuck you, cancer man. He beat it, and yet the cancer came back like surprise, no. bitch. Uh, yeah, that's cancer the thing with too, cancer. You gotta keep it. An eye on it. Man, I was thinking of, um... What was it? Like, Golden mentioned flaming Hot Cheetos or something, and then I was yeah. reminded of, uh... I was reminded of, like... So Taco Bell has a burrito where they basically just put flaming hot... Flaming Hot Fritos Shit. into a beef burrito. I want this! Yeah. It's like, I wouldn't have asked for this. But I didn't know I needed it in my life until now. Like, it's like when they, it's like when Taco Bell and I, I don't know if they still. It, I don't know if they still do this, but Wait, when they made their that? taco shells out of like Doritos. Hey, definitely. Oh yeah, the Doritos look at taco. Second, uh, do they Riza? still do it or did they change it? Guys, uh, hang on. Riza. huh? Okay, so to answer your question, no, that was Def who was uh, talking. But anyway. Uh, to answer your question on how you do that spinny thing, there's a pizza that has a bomb on it. It lets you do that for a few seconds. Oh. Oh, wait. Do they still make those uh, tacos? The, the Doritos Locos tacos? Oh, yeah, they absolutely do. They still do. Oh, God, I want something! <laughs> I you want know, to get something as people are mentioning, as people, as I brought up uh, the whole, like, the tacos thing and such, or the flaming Hot Cheetos, I'm just now remembering, because uh, I streamed it a few months ago, where this guy named Zach Coy puts together these, like, bizarre dishes, and he deep fries them with Cheeto dust. Oh, yeah, that's a thing. I mean, there was once, I think, like, someone who made a grilled cheese sandwich with literally grinded hot Cheetos. I want a grilled cheese. Sure. Grind, grind hot Cheetos on it. I don't uh, like Cheetos. Here comes, uh... Blasphemy. Token Razor. Token Razor. Yeah, first time they were in a video game. Yeah? I'd rather have cheap grilled cheese. Then go make yourself a grilled cheese. Ouch. But I'm playing a video game. Well, after you do the video game. Yeah. Great. Hey. Now mentioning the Cheetos, it just... 
Uh oh. Somebody dropped. Who did we lose? Death. Oh, oh no. No, oh, we lost death. Internet, please. Please don't, please don't get rid of the the bat pwn. <laughs> He's back. Oh hey. Hey, you're back. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Discord Betty has his... has, re has revived. Guys, yeah, yeah Jeff, For... go ahead. I was just gonna say, Discord has this weird thing that's been doing lately, where it will just randomly shut, like close out, close out. Oh, weird. Yeah. yeah, really kind of annoying. But anyway, as I was trying to say, with it's all the talk, of, all. with the talk of oh, Cheetos, I, I really wish my workplace was selling these Cheeto flavors again, which Aww. is the white California Re the California Reaper flavor. Which yes, that does in fact exist. Hey, I've control. never heard of that. Yeah, someone Cheeto literally che uh, hot che There is literally a hot Cheetos version mixed with um, California Reaper. It's actually pretty damn good. All right, folks, huh. we're in the Wild West. Bend my shell at wounded knee. <laughs> oh <God>. no! <laughs> A person sees this and goes, "Ah, oh, yes, this is Blood Meridian Turtles uh, Turtles Edition." You know, <laughs> looking at this, I'm getting vibes of Sunset Riders. Yeah, I mean that that wood yeah. that the the wood trainer standing on. I'm just like I'm now remembering. Plus, the music is very reminiscent of um, the first level, like the Konami, music. I mean, I don't think Konami made Sunset Riders, did they? Or yeah, they did. Else? Yeah, oh, it's, it was. Right it was now. a... Oh, that God. game is chugging. No, no chugs. No chugs. But no, no I... Konami would just took Contra and just took it until the Wild West. I loved it. It's kind of a shame to think about that Konami was once one of the most respected game companies out there, and now they're just a joke. They shot themselves they... in the foot with stupidity. Man, I, mean, I love listen. drone fuckers. I mean, I... That... Yeah? That card game is so unbalanced. I still... Never forgave them for canceling Silent Hills. Yes, we're getting technically uh, some new games with Silent I... Hill Death, <laughs> Silent Hill Townfall, Silent Hill Obsession, and as well as the Silent Hill, Silent Hill 2 Remake, apparently. Uh, yeah. But it, uh. it took them years for them to finally be like, hey, uh, we're back with actually making these games, remember? Everyone in the background is just. You fucked over Gamma, the Toto, Kaido, Kojima, and Junji Ito. I'm just mad for them making shitty Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Oh, I forgot that. Also, yeah, Junji Ito, the guy who did Uzumaki, he was originally the monster designer for Silent Hills, and then Konami basically said, No! Nope. We want to focus on, on Pachinko Machines. <laughs> I like yeah. Pachinko Machines. They're stupid. And then... And then the pandemic happened, and then they realized, oh, wait, this was stupid. You know, every time I think of pachinko machines, I think of that one from Mario Sunshine. Oh, God. I see <laughs> the one where right, Aaron yeah. is trying to play through that oh. in Game Grumps, and he just lost yeah. his mind. Yeah. There was so a... I'm reminded of, like, a kind of, kind of somewhat Depper-related story when it comes to Mario Sunshine, is that, uh... There's a guy, uh, uh, Dan Riker, you know, he's a video game journalist, whatever. Um, and he was talking about how, like, when he was in college, like, uh, because some of you probably remember, like, the Wavebird controller for the GameCube, right? Yeah, no, I, think so. I think so, yeah. yeah. The great, the great yeah, controller like, ever. Like, it had, you know, it had a dongle that you plugged into the GameCube. Parker. Guys, let us and, talk. Yeah. Uh, it, like, it had a dongle you plugged into the GameCube, and there was, like, a chant like a, a a number dial that was on the dongle and the wavebird controller, and basically you just set them both to the same number. So that's, how, no. so that's how they were synced, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So Dan Riker, being the dickhead that he is, found the number setting for like his dorm mates, like or like the the dorm next door. What what they were using on their Wavebird controller? They'd be playing Mario Sunshine. He would set his Wavebird controller to the same setting, and just to fuck with him, he'd like tilt the stick, and then he'd hear him. What the fuck? Why did Mario fall? <laughs> just <That's laughs> so funny. <laughs> like wow, what a dick. <laughs> like, come on, get up. Damn it. 
Also, let's pay our respect to Charles Matinee today because he retired from the role of Mario. Is this yeah. a, like is this why Chris Pratt was being casted? Wow. No, no, no. To me. No, apparently from what it says, he's still going to be heavily involved in the Mario franchise. Like, he's being the ambassador. Apparently they said he's going to be the, the ambassador, ambassador for Mario. Everything. Yeah, no, I was just... Doing but it. he's just retiring from voicing Mario. Which, to be fair, he's literally... He he's in his late 60s. He? Yes. Yeah. They're probably going to basically make him, like, a voice coach to future Marios and stuff. And I mean, possibly? if we're being completely honest... The man has done over 30 years of Mario. Bring they probably me, could man. just have, like, record his voice and just play it. <laughs> I'm against me. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> God, somebody's going overboard. Good lord. What are you going to say, Archie? Have some lives, Riley. Holy shit. Your parents need that money for groceries. <laughs> <laughs> what are we going to say, Archie? You were going to say something. Uh, mostly with, like, Charles Martinet, like, um, uh, like, That's this will enough! basically mean that really? Super Mario Wo uh, Super Mario <laughs> Wonder is going to be, like, the last game that he I'm voices the going. character for. Oh, yeah. Okay, Riley, okay. how many quarters did you put in? Thinking realistically, how much money did you spend, man? Oh, man, you didn't look at my lives, did you? Let's see, well, uh, oh shit! I was looking on the wrong spot. Riley, good lord, man! Divide one eighty-three by four. I stole Riley's coins. You stole <laughs> Riley's coins. I was about to ask, are you Bill Gates or something? Never mind. <laughs> oh, great! The future.